What is up guys, Austin Nurcho here, back again playing Ark Survival Evolved. And if you did notice, I'm kind of starting off on the um, home starting screen. And I'm doing that for a um, reason, as you will see here in a second. But I'm going to um, start up the game, and you'll see why I started off here. Um, some bad things happened, and I was not able to figure out how to change or fix these things. Um, so it's not very good for what we've done so far. So I'll go ahead and get into the game, and you'll see what went wrong. And so I just spawned in guys and this is what's wrong with the game. So I spawned in and all of my base disappeared. Look I even have a floating raptor. Um, so something happened. Let's go ahead and gamma up here real quick so I can see better. Go to, oh that did not work. Oh that's super bright. Um, but so I spawned in and everything that's S plus is gone. <laughs> Um, so as you can see my whole base except for this stuff which is just regular old stone foundation door um, storage boxes because I did all this stuff not in S plus and um, everything's yeah just gone now um, I, I still have all the dinos I have um, my inventory stuff at least for the most part like my guns and armor and everything and everything's still on the um, Bert or dinos that I had and everything um, my bed is floating. I have water still. I have the beehive, but just this is, of course, all the pipe I have left. It just all mixed and matched out through there. Um, the beehive, as I said, then um, my dinos were getting attacked by something. I can't remember what it was, but it was one of those things that was wandering around outside the base um, the last time or in the last episode, and it kind of attacked, and so it knocked my parasur all the way over here, the carna over there. But my uh, uh, Dodicarus was able to kill it and everything. Um, but my monkey's still floating. Um, he's kind of floating. Um, and so yeah, everything just has become a huge disaster in that part of thing. At least I still do have, uh, you know, dinos and everything still. So like um, rebuilding shouldn't... Well, I say shouldn't be too hard, but at least I have stuff that can help. Like, um, I need to get this stuff down, and I'll, I assume I can jump up. But I do still have my inventory full of um, things here, at least. So, like, I still have, you know, weapons and all the S plus building materials are gone now. Um, so, I'm just like, I'm saw so this. I started to play last week and was going to do another video for last week. But um, I got on and this happened and let's go ahead and get the raptor out of this guy. Um, so yeah, this happened and so there he comes. I don't know why I do that. So yeah, this happened. So I was like, I have no clue what to do now. So I was, you know, taking time thinking, what should I do? Should I, you know, just can take from, go from here and just, you know, continue, just rebuild, you know, obviously this stuff won't be exactly the same or should I just move on to something else um, I thought about going to a different um, map but I don't really like any of the maps um, as much like I eventually I don't know because I was like I do like other maps but not very much because it's hard to find like certain resources and moving a long way and stuff like that it's just um, annoying to me um, so I want to rebuild on arc here and so i think to start off i'm just gonna um, start by fencing this whole area off so i'm gonna like start over there um and like block that whole so i'll put like a rail um, row of stuff over there all the way across just blocking this whole stuff off so no more dinos will be able to get in over here while i'm waiting to build or like working to build stuff so i'll build like a house over here so let's see if where is I've just by it I say where's the beaver um, let's go ahead and grab some of this wood um, gosh all these dinos in the way blocking my route let's run over here and let's grab some fiber and let's go ahead and start um, so I don't think trying to so 
there was something wrong with S plus. So like I did notice it until after I uh, where is what? so this is all S plus. So out of the S plus stuff, I'm gonna go ahead and do the foundation still. Um, so I'll just like you know continue using that for now. Probably just come up over in here and just put it down. But there was something wrong where S plus wasn't showing up and I had already hit the start button before I noticed it. Oh. And so when it that's what happened when it logged in and there was no base here at all. Um, so because the S plus wasn't on the game, there was no way to uh, or everything S plus disappeared. So I tried to like um, what do we call it? Like, um, re like go back in time and do another or a reset is what I'm trying to say. Do a reset, and it could only go back to the start of that, which was when the whole S plus stuff was gone. So I was just you know out of luck. I'm just stuck where <laughs> with it where I'm at, and I couldn't get anything to come back. So yeah, I'm just SOL as far as stuff like that goes. Um, we'll go ahead and craft one two so I'm pretty much like I said just gonna do only foundations um, in S plus and then everything else will be normal so in case it happens again of course if the foundations go everything else will go too um, but for like building purposes being able you know to build on not flat areas is the only reason why so let's go in here and then I don't know if how I can get to um, non okay so here's all the non stuff so we will go with so of course we need one doorway one door wherever the door one that we would have the other thing uh, so we go with one door and then we'll go ahead and just do all four walls. And then what do we need? Because we'll do a ramp. So we need some more wood. But yeah, so um, like I said, it's good. One That's one nice thing about having all these dinos available still is that I can still build. Um, you know, use the beaver to gather wood, the dodickers to gather stone, and you know, all that sort of stuff. Um, let's go ahead and build a ramp. And I think the no collision thing is still on, so hopefully that will um, help with things for a while. So let's go. I don't know which one I need to place first. We'll place it there and let's go five. Hopefully that will work. Um, so we'll put the walls, of course, put the door down. Although it was nice having the door, I should have, I'll probably switch out the doors at least to the S. Plus. I didn't think about that. Um, five, five. 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 And we need more walls, I bet. So we need what? One, what? F five more walls? Yep, five. Let's go with number. How many is it? Oh, 11. Five. And we'll get these placed. And then I just want to make a little. Um, slope building type thing so I do need to build two of these and two of these here we go and let's go with five I need to adjust the thing because I can't see oops that's the wrong one imagine that I hit the wrong thing okay and now we need thatch sloped thatch roof sloped thatch roof and then we need what 
six. Six wall ceilings. I don't need that anymore. Five. Oops. That's the problem with building this stuff. Now I can't pick that up. I just have to destroy it. Build one last one. And then we'll at least have a little house and I can get a bed made and put a bed in here. There we go. So yeah, we at least have, oh, I hate the way this looks. Like I like that, but I hate the whole bottom thing. Oh well. So we there have our little house shed and I need to pick up this or destroy the, of course I don't know if that's all that's holding. Probably not. Um, I will just leave it. So like I said, I need a bed, which it, I don't know if I can demolish the bed. Let's see if what I need to build a new bed. Um, bed. We have enough. So we got a bed crafted, and then I'm going to. I probably don't, because I'm going to check the inventory, because I know I had a whole bunch. But let's go in here, and we'll just do a five right here. So there we have a bed down just in case we die, which is possible. Um. Oh yeah, I said I was going to check the building, and we do not have any. So I'm going to build um, uh, probably need the stone and do the um, fence foundations, and I'll just do like I have been doing. So yeah, the stone fence foundations. Um, and I'm just gonna, like I said, place, which it's probably gonna mess everything up. Um, like I'll go find, like over here, I'll probably, so I was thinking over here, I'll probably put like a door, so in case, you know, I walk around, um, from like that away, I'll put like a dino door somewhere over here, um, in this big area. I will then put like over in this area put a uh, behemoth gate like right over in here so that way if I get you know a t-rex a brano anything like that I can walk through but I'll place it right over in here somewhere and then just fence off all of this area you know sh across here like just fence all this whole area off um, probably it's going to take the gun out to show so from like whatever rocks doesn't I can't destroy which are probably that one and then just like fence it all the way off over to these rocks and then probably over to there because I want to have this upper area for something or at least I did that was an intention um, so I will start um, to work on that and bring it back at some point whether it's uh, to end off the video because I probably won't, won't get all because I want to do all that and then once I get done with that I do want to fence all this area off just so I don't have to worry about dinos uh, falling off the side um, but I will start working on some stuff and bring it back at some point throughout the whole building process. So um, I will start building and I'll be right back. Okay, so I got some progress done. I got all of the foundations laid over there. So now I need to start crafting stuff. And I went ahead and put a uh, furnace or a finding forge and an S plus crafting station on here um, to be able to use the build. Of course, I'll move it and everything. But let's go ahead and because now we're ready to build I think it's stone the behemoth so I need four four fifty of each um, so let's go ahead and so grab four fifty of each one two three four five six seven eight nine I believe it is because I need one for the uh, door frame as well so let's go ahead and one two three four five six seven eight nine. Oh, come on and then we need wood one two three four five six seven eight nine so I'm so surprised I can carry all this of course my weights like ridiculous though one two three four five six seven eight 
Got that. And nine. And then stone now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Let's go ahead and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So let's go with stone. Behemoth, and of course, we're doing the S plus because with this stuff, I want to be able to pick it up and just in case. So we'll craft one and behemoth gate one. So I'm going to take that. And that okay, um, so like pretty much anything like these things, I want S plus just in case I uh, miss them, and then the Behemoth Gate I want S plus, but everything else I, oh, uh, and then the fa those foundations, because I messed up quite a bit, so um, I'm kind of glad I did that. Where is the bird? At? I just want to do it to get a little bit faster transportation over here. Um, so I had gotten some of the stuff cleared away. Um, so as you see, so I got all the railing or the fence foundation all the way there because this rock does not break. So I was able to connect it to that. And then over here is kind of weird. So I found, um, so this is a part of the non-breaking stone. So it's connected or lines up with that and then comes all the way over here to this air rock and then I build it up over this way because I decided not to uh, use all this because it was way too big so I just fenced it off around there and then built that there so be a dino gate on this side a behemoth gate over there maybe another dino gate in between there but yeah this whole area was a lot bigger than I um, was expecting it to be of course I could have just like cut off cut it off some but it's fine I'll just um, not use it but yeah, so I may put a dino gate over here or something. But let's go ahead and stick the behemoth gate. Now the problem is I don't want... Um, I believe a lot of these rocks can go probably. Um, so let's go ahead and get in my inventory thing. We'll put the behemoth gate there. Let's hop off. And then let's go five. This does not look like a behemoth gate. Because I don't want the uh, fence foundations or the fence stuff. I'm going the wrong direction completely. I think somewhere kind of like right over in here. Oh, right, like right there would be perfect. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I believe I just need to take out seven railings. I don't know exactly how that works in this case. I know if I put it down though and then take the railings out, it gets destroyed. So I don't want to do that. So I got my demo gun back again. And yeah, I think focus right on here so one two ooh, three four five maybe we'll come back over this way six and seven okay so now let's get rid of that Let's see what it looks like now. Oh, I'm not even close to lining up for. Oh, it's off the ground there. That's one thing I did not want, but. Maybe if I move. So I think I'm going to have that problem no matter what though. So let's just go ahead. And I can't tell if I need to turn a little bit more. 
maybe just a l let's see which way maybe just a little this way Yeah, that's probably pretty good. There we go. Oh, I don't know what I just whistled. Hopefully nothing else is close enough to hear that whistle. Because I don't know if that was an all whistle or what. Let's see, I don't see anything else over here whistled to me. So I said, hopefully I can destroy all this. Let's see if I can hit any of this. Okay, so I can hit that. I can hit that. Okay, so all this can probably go. Just that big rock. Um, and then, of course, once I get the fence foundations, um, it should cut off pretty much most of this. Like, I may have a little bit of problems, but it shouldn't be too bad. So let's go ahead and put the door up now five there we got our big behemoth gate now so now we can do that so now we just need a bunch of fin or railings so now I will go to work on the railings and I will oh that Akatina's still there because my <laughs> taming pin disappeared so that I still got the little Akatina little snail of course, I don't see any of it. snail paste stuff. So I will start building railings, I guess. And then I will come back once I can start putting some up. So I will bring that back for the end. Okay, guys. So I got some of this stuff placed. So I got um, the three high railing press, um, press uh, put up there. And I may do more than three, like four, possibly five. Um, and then so I'm getting ready to work on this side to there and I went ahead and crafted up um, the dino door so there's one of course I need to clear out those rocks and stuff um, but there's a dino door there and then I got the other one um, placed over it there there's a turtle um, so I'll have to uh, now just put down all the railing um, like I said, I think I may go four, because I think it's like with three high, it'll keep stuff. I know with walls for sure, and um, uh, railings aren't as high as three, so um, probably not high enough. So I'll do four, maybe five, one just to make it look a little better. And I um, have this little opening here. I was able to place a like ra uh, whatever fence railing. Um, the S plus thing that's supposed to like help keep stuff all the same height um, but uh, so I was able to get it placed under there to do that but I still have that little gap opening there it's so weird like standing behind the door like how dark it is like shadow wise um, so now we can just go through and continue placing all the railings along here and that's probably um, where I'm going to end for this episode of course we're just having to rebuild um, trying to uh, get all this stuff caught up from when or how uh, oops that's not good um, the mess up with the S plus thing just completely destroyed all my base so like all these railings of course like I said doesn't matter because I used um, S plus foundation so if something happens again and they're gone all of this will disappear again as well but hopefully I will always check to make sure there's nothing wrong with S plus before I go on and use it was it had just enough to do all of that in the three high um, but that's gonna be it for this episode Let's see if I can run I had to turn this off because I'm tired of opening and closing all by itself um, but that's gonna be it for this video so if you enjoy guys Please ooh, look under the world. You can see everything. Um, but that's going to be it for this video. So if you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below. And hit the red subscribe button to see more. Oh, I got no head on. Now I do. Now I don't. Now I do. Now I don't. Um, but hit the subscribe button to help it, um, it, us increase. Because we did hit our 200 subscriber mark. Um, so I'm super happy about that. I'm so excited. Um, 
but just um, subscribe if you want to um, help join the um, nerd squad because we're a bunch of nerds here um, but uh, join our group subscribe and um, hopefully as we grow things will get better I'll be able to make improvements and better the channel and hopefully your viewing pleasure but please help out everything and we'll see you next time